Hey everybody, Chris Farad here. Welcome back. Demon Souls, we've got a fog wall and what looks like a giant behind it. Um, I can't find an arch stone for the life of me. So I'm going to run in here and probably just start running in circles. Holy Jesus. Wow. <laughs> what is this guy? Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, I'm gonna be running as far and as fast as I can, preferably away from this giant dude. Whoa. Use arrows. Okay. Like, this is craziness! Can I hide here? Okay, at least I've got a little safety. Jesus. Prepare for profanity. I hope that killed him. So many goddamn archers. No, 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 don't fall. Okay. Thank God for moon grass. I think this is probably the right thing, though. Is try and get rid of these bastards. So I can focus on, like, one thing at a time. Although, I don't really know where I'm going! Coward. <laughs> what is that, like a safe spot there? Doesn't look very safe with all the shit that he's launching at me. And I think some of them might still be alive down at the bottom. Yeah, they are. Whoa! Okay, archers are down. Oh my god. Tower Knight, this guy's called. Uh... This is like... Insane. I'm trying to figure out how I would even... ...get to this guy. I guess I'm just gonna have to beeline it down to him. Okay, once we're down here... Wow. Okay. So I can't block him. <laughs> Jesus. Certainly not dealing a lot of damage. I'm running like a schoolgirl. That did literally no damage. I wonder if I should just straight up two hand this guy. That might be better.
if I hit him, maybe. Whoa. Oh my god. Ah! Okay, so he's got a little shield chargey bash thing. Okay, I can kind of stay away from it. Oh, shit. Try and stay behind him. That does, like, zero damage to the guy, though. Well, he's got something spraying out of his boots. Uh oh How do I get to the other boot? There we go. That looks like something's happened, maybe. Okay, I want to be full health. Ah, oh, damn it. I think something's happening there. I just can't figure out how to switch to the right boot. Maybe I don't need to. Whoa. It's like he's kind of confused on where I am, but not really. Shit. Okay, I'm gonna regroup here. Come back at him again. Thankfully, he's somewhat predictable. Actually, I might even... I shouldn't be using my heals, maybe. Because I don't have magic for any other purpose. Boot with the stuff shooting out of it. That's what I really want. Alright, I'm just gonna focus on the other boot then. Something's happening. Not sure what. <laughs> Let's see if I can get him to do that again. Uh oh. That's not cool. Seven damage, just like nothing. This is good. Uh oh. Oh. Come on. Oh shit. I'm out of here. <laughs> this is so gnarly right now.
Okay. Let's be patient. I'm gonna try to get to the other side where I can be a little closer to him. This is ridiculous! Do your bash. There you go. Whoa! Oh, this is bad. Okay. Oh, actually, maybe this is where I should go for his head. Yes, go! Okay, hold on. Let's regroup. Alright. We can do this. There's light at the end of this dreary, dark-ass tunnel. I do not want to get caught here. I need him to do his bash. That gives me some time. Here we go. Oh no. That's not it. There. Come on, Tower Knight. Uh oh. Uh oh. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. All right, that was intense. -hoo -hoo! Wow. Wow, give me an arch stone. Thank you. Tower Knights trophy, baby. <laughs> oh, that was so intense. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, hold on. I want to check the area because I was in such a frickin' panic there that I wasn't sure if we were gonna make it. That is awesome! Just that feeling when you beat a boss like that. Especially... Oh man, that's just... When they're so big, you just feel like, obviously, David versus Goliath, but... on an expanded scale. That was wild. Got a whole bunch of souls. Did we pick up a, uh... Let's see here. We didn't pick up another demon soul. I mean, it dispels miracles or weapons, but as far as I can tell, we didn't get one from this guy. I was probably a little too cautious there, but uh, don't care because we're alive. He's not. And my main driving force for that whole fight was I really, really don't want to have to run back through that bridge. Oh, here, Iron Demon Soul. Perfect. Let's check it out. Uh, the soul of the Demon Tower Knight. It radiates a strong power. Grants the holder a large number of souls when used. Alternatively, can be made into spells. Okay, it's the same thing. Wow. Yes, let's return to the Nexus. Let's get buff.
Ostrava of Boletaria. So we haven't seen on these loading screens, we haven't seen the phalanx, we haven't seen the iron or the tower knight. So I'm guessing that my theory about them being like bosses are not correct. This girl's in a different spot every time. Okay, first of all, since I have the money, I can forge weapon. Let's uh, let's do this. I think I finally have enough. Yep, shard of hardstone, halberd plus one. Let's do it. We'll also do some repairs that are not cheap. Do come. And let me just check out the shield that I have here for a second. I think it's 100% uh, physical reduction. Uh, 100% damage reduction. I can full. Let's see if he has anything else. In the long run, it's probably better for me to just use this. Is it a one time use item, though? That's what I'm not sure about. No interest. I can tell you. No. Okay. Thou seeketh so then touch. Okay, let's. I keep the candles lit and serve the brave demon slayers who are trapped here. Soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Soul of the lost, withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. So both strength and endurance um, give us additional physical defense, which is good. I'm going to keep buffing strength, though. I am going to go into vitality a couple of times. And... Art thou done? Main that Let's see here. Our halberd. Scales. It does scale with dex, but I don't think I need dexterity. I need 10 of it for this compound short bow, which is probably going to replace my light crossbow. I'll store my catalyst. Oh, I'm keeping it. Where is it? It's a wooden catalyst. To use spells, the following conditions must be met. You've learned a spell, you've memorized a learned spell, you have a catalyst equipped, and you have the the mana points, I think that's what it's called, required to cast the spell. Uh, so that can go. The crossbow... Uh, um, hmm. Let's just you see. You have a heart of gold. Can I manually aim this thing? Okay, perfect. That's what I want. So... We're gonna equip some arrows. They're heavy arrows, but that's fine for now. Hello, I'm keeping... And then that'll let us get rid of... We can get rid of the mail breakers. We'll keep one mail breaker, I guess, just in case. We can carry actually quite a bit. So it's not that huge of an issue. If only something could be done to help her. He's talking about... I. Th you have a heart of gold. There was something that happened when I went to talk to him, and I accidentally skipped what he said, and it was something about a girl. I can forge. Uh, so let's see here. We can't go any further. We need four shards of hardstone now. Oh yeah, I was gonna buy arrows from him. God, really? These are so expensive. Let's spend... Here's what we'll do. 
will level. No interest, eh? So I'm not I sure that aggro you. is going to work the same based now on how those archers so replied. Then so I'll level and then whatever's the left candle. over. Soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Soul of the lost, withdraw. I'll out spend on arrows. Main that. It's simple. And trade with your soul. Do come. Okay, so we'll have the heavy arrows to use up first. Uh, now, I do want to go back to the Archstone at the Demon Tower Night. Where the streets intertwine lies a trap set by the fat official, an embodiment of the old King Alan's madness. Interesting. So that, yeah, because there was that guy, that's right. When we first entered the area, there was that chubby dude who was like, I don't know if he summoned this or if he was like, get him. But, um... The Fat Official, an embodiment of the old King Alant madness. This King Alant, I swear. If we ever meet him, it's game on. Okay, now. What's behind this one? A thick colorless fog holds you back. Only those who have slain an archdemon can pass beyond this point. Okay. So, we- until we slay an archdemon... I think we're stuck in this area. Or, uh, we can't proceed any further in this area. Which means we're gonna have to test out another archstone. So this was the tar archstone of the small king. Archstone of the Burrow King. City of the Burrowers, keeper of this huge tunnel. Most of the stubborn excavators who supported the soldiers of Boletaria had their souls taken. Lacking their own will, they mindlessly continue working. What other ones do we have? The Tower Queen. Old man took revenge on the queen by locking her family in a prison with inhuman guards. All that escapes are pl the place are the prisoner's cries. And probably my own. This one's broken. The Archstone of the Shadow Men. The island shrine of the Shadow Men who worship storms and mourn the dead. Here the storm bees fly above, and the souls of the dead inhabit empty skeletons to move about freely. Archstone of the Chieftain. This damp valley is the resting place of those who have been thrown away. Overtaken by poison and plague, the dwellers attack anyone who wanders into the valley, hoping to offer souls to the woman who showed compassion. Yeah, that place looks like Blight Town. Nope. I'm gonna try just going to the next one. See what that does for us. I think we'll probably know right away if the enemies are way too strong to decide on another one. But I like the idea of stone burrowers. They don't seem very strong. <laughs> so I'm probably making a couple of radical assumptions here, but that's all that I have to go on. Okay. So we can go that way. The hell? Wait. Oh, there's a person. I camouflage. Hello there, souls. Souls. I trade fine goods for souls. You have anything for 13 souls? Moongrass. Oh, look at this. Okay, I can actually buy shards from you. That is really good to know. I will definitely be doing that. Our little town. Well... Going on back it's there. a nice wee place. All those lizard-eyed townsfolk are busy tinkering with stone. And don't bother with old men like myself. Makes life rather easy for me. I can get away with anything. 
<laughs> Thank you, Lord, for this golden opportunity. <laughs> so you're a sketchy dude in the land of sketchy. You're filthy man, that's your name. Have you heard about that sparkling lizard? He's not easy to catch. But he's got some fine stones. See, now and he's just I rubbing it in. No, where his nest is. Oh, oh, really? I'm sorry. I can't give it away. Oh, come <laughs> on. I think he's talking about those little um, shiny lizards that we find. Thank you, Lord, for the. Have you heard? He's an and I oh. Okay. You want to play? There's treasure. Oh yeah, look at this. Giant blood stain. Look at him. He's like, well, what do I have to lose? And... You're dead. Oh, but there is something down there. Ha! <laughs> there is something down there. I will not be going for it, though. Whoa. Yeah, no doubt. Alright, so there's these dudes throwing stuff off the top of a wall. They're throwing, like, giant-ass boulders, it looks like. So, this should be fun. This looks like another dragon bridge. Anyways, we're gonna take a break. We come back, we'll, uh, start exploring Stonefang Tunnel. And, uh, if they're all throwing rocks, that might be a bit more difficult than anticipated, but, uh, we'll soon find out. Alright, thanks guys. See you later, bye.